What's going on gentlemen? Today it's boys night. That means no ladies allowed, which means if you're a girl and you're watching this video, I'm afraid you can't stick around. But anyway, if you're a guy and we're just here, you and me, right here, you and me, then we're going to be talking about the top five, my top five favorite outfits that you can wear that will just make you look so much better and that girls just love. So let's get into it, starting with number one. Okay, so before I show you anything, you have to understand these three principles, all right? One, it has to fit you well. The clothes that you wear has to fit you well. That's like given guaranteed, okay? I know there's trends about wearing different styles of like clothing, how it fits and that kind of thing. What I'm sharing with you is just what has generally worked for generations, okay? And what has continued to work and men still wear them. All right, so that's what I'm going with and that's the foundation I'm gonna lay for you guys because I understand trends happen all the time, but they're trends for a reason. They don't always work. Okay, let's get into it. Outfit number one. Again, I'm sharing principle. This is a plain black shirt. It's not too big. It's not too tight. It accentuates my chest. It's nice around the arms. You want to have clothes that just makes you look better than what you do actually look like. Okay, so you can never go wrong with a black shirt. I think pairing it with jeans, slacks, um, some trousers, or even like, I'm not exactly sure what type of pants these are, but I know it looks good because it's very simple, very neutral, and of course, some black boots. I think any man will look better, significantly better with boots. It's just something that you have to wear if you want to come across more masculine, so. Anyway, that's the first outfit. Let's do number two. Okay, so I know most men love wearing wife beaters personally. I love wearing them, but it's really difficult to make them work alone. So the way I love to style these, really it works almost every single time. You just grab any button up. I have yet to see a button up that does not work, but you just literally, any button up you want. Sometimes you can add a little bit of color you can make it black, you can make it um, another white one, you can use a little bit of blue, you can use a flannel, doesn't matter. Literally any button up, it would just make it so much better. You have taken an outfit that could look trashy and you have made it sexy, okay? And again, have your watch, you can roll up your sleeves, I'm not going to do it right now because it will take too long. but. Roll them up, okay, show a little bit of forearm. If you're not working out, hit the gym. Come on, bro, what you doing? That should be step one before you even get here. Anyway, you can do it like this. You can tuck it in, wear a belt. Ooh, I'll show you guys what it looks like when you wear a nice buckle with these shirts. Okay, so honestly, I don't know if it's just me, but just cowboy belts have been just doing a, <laughs> a lot of goodness in my life lately. So. I really think if you want to play around with it, wearing a nice belt that's western, I don't know why, but it just it hits every time. I have yet to see someone that doesn't like it. It adds a little bit of that western vibe to you, even if you're not western at all. It's still something that stands out. People will love it. You'll always get compliments on it because it's different. And it's just it's something that makes an outfit pop, especially if you wear gold jewelry. So that is outfit number two, button ups with wife beaters. Okay, so with this one, with outfit number three, it's an oversized sweater. Now I recommend something that is soft and that doesn't have too much design. That's just a preference and ultimately I've found that to more people have liked more simplistic sweaters. Uh, just make sure it's soft, it smells nice. Spray some cologne on there. But honestly, an oversized sweater just reeks like boyfriend material. Like I, every girl will love an oversized sweater on a man. Like it's just, it's like the most like, like husband, boyfriend material type stuff you could ever wear. It looks nice. It feels comfortable. You can wear it with slacks. You can wear it with boots, sneakers. And it's just something that hits every single time. I've never seen anybody not like it. And if you want to wear it with like a dress, like a dress shirt or 
or a t-shirt that way it sticks out with the dress shirt the collar will stick out a little bit the sleeves will stick out a little bit with this dress shirt and then if you wear a t-shirt you might just get the white lining right here which normally I wear oversized sweaters with nothing so I just wear the sweater alone but it's really hard to mess this one up so this is outfit number three the oversized sweater okay so this is outfit number four it is sneakers white sneakers with slacks and polo um, you can be of course a little playful with this I recommend staying with the neutral colors but neutral always goes well with a little pop of color if you have too much color it just it kind of messes everything up and it's just too much so if you want to come across as masculine subtle but also confident then I recommend matching or adding the color with so basically 70% neutral colors and then a pop of color, if that makes sense. So, of course you can't go wrong with white shoes, white polo, and slacks. Hard hitter, works every time, girls love it, and uh, yeah, this is outfit number four. Alright, so for this one, the last but not least, and I feel like you guys saw this one coming, it is the stri straight up black on black. Now, this is by far the best thing and the most favorite thing that I've ever worn and people just go crazy including myself for the whole black on black and I forgot my belt let me grab it you can do any honestly any black belt works um, I recommend something that has a little bit of silver a little bit of gold on it depending on what jewelry jewelry you're wearing so for this one this is this is just a belt that has held up for a very long time and you guys have probably recognized multiple multiple times it's my Louis Vuitton belt um, yeah and it, it just works I have other black belts but sometimes they don't pop that much so black outfit all black roll up the sleeves a little bit however you want to do it and of course you want to unbutton the top okay I'm so I feel so bad for the person that buttons it all the way to the top and like hides what's going on here right so you don't have to wear it all the way down here all right you don't have to be that guy but i recommend at least two buttons minimum two buttons i personally like three and that is right around here so it gives me enough to play with but it's not like overpowering where it's like that and you're seeing like stomach right so and if you want to make this a little bit more bougier right because this alone looks nice but if you want to add a little bit of color, you can take, honestly, there's a lot of suit jackets that will make this look really nice. If it has a black accent to it, that of course will work. I personally love red, so, and uh, red just looks so nice whenever you throw it on with all black. So this is something that you can wear. It just looks so elegant, so sophisticated. Um, or you could do the black on black. Now, I actually, I don't have like an all black sport coat, unfortunately. Um, you would think I have one, but I have this one, which is like, it has like, it's like black, but it has a little bit of a pattern on it. So it kind of pops a little bit, yet it still plays really well because it's mainly black. So, yeah. And of course, guys, everything that you saw me use was... It just it allowed my body to look better because of the proportions I was playing with, the color. So these of course are my top five favorite outfits and they just they just work and I'm sure they will work for you. You just gotta style them right. You have to make sure you have the detail. You have to make sure it fits you right. The only exception for something that doesn't fit you right is like an oversized hoodie or sweater. If you wanna play it like that, I agree with that one, but most other things you're gonna want to have fit you. Like this, a sport coat, it's gonna look better if it just fits you. Okay, it's gonna make you look stronger, bigger, badder, all that good stuff. So, and look, if you want to get a little playful with it, you grab a black cowboy hat and you throw that on. Maybe some black cowboy boots, but you get the idea. Okay. Anyway, guys, that was the video for today. Let me know if you guys liked it down below and if I should do a part two. I'll see you guys later. Oh, follow my IG. It's linked down below.